So hi, uh, my name is Irina Charlotte Rana Yifosoa. Uh, I'm from France. I studied in Birmingham at the LLM General from 2015 to uh, from 2013 to 2015. I studied it part time uh, because I had to fund obviously the degree. Uh, so I had to work part time and study part time. Um, so the thing in doing uh, LM General uh, in Birmingham is I realized in the middle of my of the studies, the master degree, that I enjoyed studying it, but did not want to work as a lawyer. <laughs> I realized it. Okay, uh, and I did my thesis, my final thesis on the human rights to peace. Um, and, but I realized that I wanted to study peace, like as a subject, what it was. So everything around in terms of law, the human right to peace, that was the uh, theme of my thesis, uh, international human rights law, humanitarian law, all of this, you know, it's all around peace, but it's not studying properly. So I realized that I graduated and I wanted to uh, go and study actually peace in, a, in another master in Spain. But I was like, okay, but I can't just keep on studying. So I keep that in my at the in the back of my head, and I'm gonna work or volunteer, get some experience before, you know, going back to studying something I really want to study. So first thing I did is I applied to the International Student Service, and I got in. I went to Senegal for three months. So I said from uh, September 2015 to December 2015. Uh, and afterwards, in uh, January 2016, I, I started to look uh, in the alumni internships and um, stuff like that were the University of Birmingham was proposing. And I got accepted in the internship as a, a social media officer uh, at the UK Subsys Trust. Uh, so I stayed there for five months until uh, July 2016 and I went on doing um, a month uh, yeah a couple of months as a, a senior mentor for the NCS um, program for young young people of 16 17 and after that I left the UK and I did I went to Vietnam for a year doing um, it's kind of the ICS but in France service civic it's called so i applied to many of these missions that were abroad that were funded by the french government that got uh, i got in in the vietnam uh, position as a, a development communication and marketing officer that was kind of the main part of a uh, training um, hospitality training center project in the highlands of vietnam so I stayed there for 12 months from October 2016 to uh, October 2017. And um, in 2018, that's where I started the masters I wanted to study about peace. And I stayed there for um, two years and a half. It's the International Master in Peace, Conflict and Development Studies in Castellón de la Plana in Spain. And while doing that, I um, I worked as a project assistant. And when I finished my uh, my master in peace and uh, conflict and development studies in February 2021, I went to Colombia afterwards. So that was in June 2021 as an international human rights uh, observer. So I stayed there for 10 months until May 2022. And now I'm back where I'm from, the town where I'm from in Toulouse, as a, it's called, it's a mediator position. But, um, you know, I hesitated between law and diplomacy, uh, chose law because I, I knew how it worked really. Um, but really, what I want is trying to do some good somewhere. 
then I realized, okay, I want to study peace. I think that's the word that I like. And then I just want to know how we build it, how we can construct it, how more the philosophy of it as, as peace per se, and not what is not peace, like obviously war, violence, or non-violence, which is part of peace, but is not peace per se. At the top level of country management or even just enterprises, companies, we just need more women to see more diversity in this sense in terms of uh, gender e equality, equity at the top level. Because when we talk about peace, I think the people that are making peace at the community level, the individual level, in between families, maybe interpersonal relation relations, I think women are the, maybe the ones that are more on the day to day working towards it, or you know creating culture of peace. The women are more on, on the ground working towards peace and making this world go around, really. I mean, we're all doing it, uh, but maybe the role or, yeah, the efforts women are obviously making towards peace is less seen and less promoted.